A number of Southland schools, including some Catholic campuses, closed today, sending all of their students home after officials with the L.A. Archdiocese say they received a wave of threats. Police say the schools all received threatening emails and evacuated their campuses as a precaution. KTLA's Jacqueline Sarkeesian has the latest from Compton. It was a chaotic and scary Monday morning for several Catholic and non-Catholic schools in the L.A. area. Students were forced to evacuate after the Archdiocese of Los Angeles received an email threatening school safety. Did people seem scared or worried? I think so, yeah. <laughs> the students and parents, you know. Yeah. Were I think you scared? So, yeah. A little. Miguel Mendoza is a maintenance worker at Our Lady of Victory in Compton. It was one of the many schools impacted. You can see from this Sky Fi video, police responded with a heavy presence, closed down several surrounding streets, and evacuated the entire school within minutes. The police guys only checked the rooms, the school, and the yard, everything. No, it's no, everything's okay. No, no problems. It was then when Compton resident Ashley Mora knew something was wrong. All the kids were coming out early, and I found it strange because school doesn't end till like around 2.30. So I was like, oh, why are they leaving so early? I had left like around 11.30, and I had seen kids. Authorities have yet to confirm what type of threat was made, but according to the archdiocese, the email was similar to the one sent out to schools in Europe last week. Thankfully, it was found not to be credible and only meant to cause panic and fear. And regardless of the threat, it has one woman feeling indifferent to the situation. Not too different from just the shootings that happened, but it's a bigger threat because a bombing doesn't just affect the students. It affects the neighborhood in itself. Video captured other Catholic schools like Damien High School in Laverne and Bishop Amont in La Puente also making the decision to cancel classes and evacuate campus. Jacqueline Tarkesian, KTLA 5 News.